Here we are, going back to Film Multiverse. Just applying the magpie. It's going great. Besides the fact that we're carrying an artillery system around that we're not using. <laughs> and, um, yeah, just give us repairs. There's the merchant. Let's see if we can get to him. We can sell missiles, yeah. We have plenty. We can spare a few. Uh, need to get away from this willy sector. Get out of my... I better not get it for my med bay. Okay. See how many dudes you got in there, but you really have to send all of them my way. Uh, tune them out. They hit my ship. I will hit their face. Whether or not it'll be very successful in that endeavor is to be seen, but hey, might as well make it a threat already, right? Yeah. Alright, Tom Banks, you be a distraction. Jump out of the airlock. Sometimes you just need a bit more bomb. We still have plenty of them. 
It's a nice bomb, I'm gonna say. It's not something I say often. Kinda of sucks that it seems like you guys are just good at everything. You know? Yeah, reduce damage from fire. That combined with the medics. Oh look, missile fired. I wouldn't have. Stop being good at your goddamn job. This won't end, will it? That's all you need to make a ship immune to fire. Four medics and four of those, whatever those were. Sell some stuff to you. <clears throat> uh, let's get some more scrapping, I guess. Use another power ball. I need to check if I can make that. Uh, thing in the jig. You know, the thing in the jig. Scrambler. Thank you. 
Alright, come on. Keep it in mind. Did he really get a heal off of that? <clears throat> Was that time for just... Luck. Am I immune to fire as well or something? Regular fire which generates self fire slash short life and fighting. Oh, is it just a regen that's helping him? Technically he's fire fighting. If you wanna get all technical about it. Just making sure you guys get to stay toast. Wow. Thanks, Firebee. <clears throat> Look, everybody in good health. Uh, let's see if we can find an empty beacon and then. Um, one of them things. Magnetic payload. Um, hacking. It's not a neural disruptor, is it? Who are stunned in the hack room for the duration of the hacking pulse? On board tech. Defense scrambler. Wow, just enough. I'm getting it. Just kick back and do a whole bunch of nothing. Phase one, kill most of the crew, which usually results in, in me killing all of them. After that, we switch out torch for pew 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 pew. Um, yeah, it'll be grand. Deploy the mech. Deploy the payload. Do we use it now? Um, no, I'll use it on the final phase on its weapon system.
Okay. Why are you repairing? <laughs> Please tell me. I'm curious. Ninety percent evasion, that's where that gets you. Oh, medics. Yeah, of course. Medics. How could I forget about those little bundles of joy? Okay. So they're in trouble, we're in trouble. But we have brain power. They have numbers. Depending on who you ask, one is better than the other. Hey, at least one of my missiles has landed. That's good. Some evasion is not going to be helping us here. See? <laughs> How did he know? I, I just do. Just going out of from the worst case scenario, and you'll generally be correct. And if not, you're pleasantly surprised. So, no matter how you look at it, things are good. Um, in this case, our things are far from good. How do we get out of this spiral of doom and despair? An upgraded medbay would have helped. Let's begin venting. Sixty percent evasion. That's also not helping. I'm starting to get kind of sick of this. I am not innately an angry man, but seeing the odds stacked against me time and time again does bring out some nuisance. And now his guy's gonna die because he's stunned. How the hell did he get stunned? Seriously, how did that happen? Oh, 
enemy rebels can stun crew with a special ability. So only the rebels can do that, though. So you see, I don't even think his ion can stun. Well, then again, what else is there, right? <sighs> On the bright side, we finally got them into our mid bay. It doesn't happen that often that you can be out of shields, out of vengeance, and still be somewhat okay. Stabilize. Make sure that they don't. Nice fire beam. We need a whole bunch of crud fixed. Get to work. killing a few more but I don't see how not until they're willing to go into piloting If it kills a guy.
All that we lost five hull and one crew member. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. All right, after him. Uh, this is where he's using the drones. No, we won't do anything. Engine hack. Eh. Whatever. Whatever. Well, I know where my first uh, drone is gonna go. Oh, yeah, just go straight through the door. Why not? Sure, doors open. Go nuts. Here somewhere, right? Don't know. Hey, he's got this. He'll be fine. Phase two. Phase three is what? Mind control, cloak, hack. I don't think he has drones anymore. Well, in the Zoltan shield, but... Anybody? You know, hacking, just cloaking. Magnetic payload. Weapons. Boom. Because you can't do artillery. It doesn't work on the flagship.
Oh yeah, I forgot. Like every everything that hits starts fires now. It's not supposed to, but it, well, I'm not sure if it's not supposed to. You never know with these multiverse guy, these multiverse lads. Wouldn't put it past him to make that 100 percent, you know. Join in on the action partisan beam. At least we get to see your fire once more. Not go up against the AI. Go partisan beam. <sighs> well, that's a GG, right? Out of our three lost streak, so yay! <clears throat> Alright, so that was the magpie, glad to know that's working. Um, didn't think I would have any issues with that particular one. The only unique thing is the partisan beam, and honestly it's just a mini beam that's been tweaked. Um, I don't like it, but I'm not going to change it now. Because apparently people are... <clears throat> some people get mad when I say that the Vindicator is trash artillery, so, you know, maybe there are people who will like this uh, breachy thingy. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.